Good day, fellow fiction lovers. I'm Jason Boyd, and you're listening to the Fiction File Podcast. Today, we'll cover some of the highlights from the past week. So without further preamble, let's get to it. Despite Tom Holland's public waffling on his future as the web slinger, producer Amy Pascal says the Marvel plan is to have the star in at least three more Spider-Man titles. Dark Horse, arguably the biggest comic book publisher outside of DC and Marvel, is reportedly looking for a buyer. Acquiring the publisher of original titles like Hellboy and The Umbrella Academy could conceivably mean a big coup for a streaming giant suitor. Before the upcoming The House of the Dragon was greenlit the series, there was another Game of Thrones prequel in line at HBO that got the axe. Well, it's now been reported that HBO spent $30 million for a pilot episode for the failed series before deciding to cancel it entirely. Filmmaker Cal Maddock will be at the helm of a recently announced remake of the 90s sports comedy White Men Can't Jump from 20th Century Studios. The director is fresh off production of New Line's reboot of House Party. The pages of Avengers number 50, the 750th issue overall, features a surprise twist. Galactus's new herald is none other than Kevin Plunder, also known as Kazar, Lord of the Savage Land. Although this is quite the departure from the likes of Silver Surfer, the power cosmic is surely going to upgrade the Jungle Dweller. That wraps it up for this week. Be sure to check back next week for more news highlights from the wide world of narrative entertainment. In the meantime, check out Fiction File on a social media platform near you, or head to fictionfile.com for your fiction fix. I've been Jason Boyd for the Fiction File podcast, wishing you a happy ever after.